Put your money in real estate. <laughs> Eric Jensen. And Allie Bokett. Berkshire Hathaway Real Estate. We're excited to talk about single family homes, but we also want to talk today about multifamily units. Multifamily units in, Salt Lake, in County. Salt Lake County. Salt Lake County. So we have 15 that are active. Only eight of those are under $800,000. 45 are under contract, um, and 27 are, of those are under 800000 21 sold in the last 30 days. Not as many sales take place for multi-units. No, they're just, they aren't available. They're not available. Yeah, I mean, people buy them and then hang on to them for a long time. Usually. And who's the average person? I mean, I wouldn't really say there's a first-time um, multi-family unit buyer. I mean, everybody has to start somewhere. Right. But my experience is it's usually 1031 exchange money. Exchange money or an investor that's really has money to spend on. Cash. Yeah, on, yeah. on investment properties. Yeah. yeah, well let's talk a little bit about that. I did a little research on some of these sales. One of them near the avenues in Salt Lake City, uh, 3.1 million. Okay, I think it was 17 units. Sound like a pretty good investment actually. Yeah. But it was on the market 37 days. My experience with multi units is it sometimes often takes oh, at longer. least two. Well, it <laughs> usually takes at least two to three buyers. Yeah. Because it's not an emotional buy where somebody walks in and loves the kitchen and sees them, you know, sees themselves raising their family there, and you know, it's different. So any multi unit I've ever sold typically has not just had one buyer. It's canceled. For one reason or the other, but it's usually just a business decision. Yeah, but not, not emotional. Just usually it's not. A, it's a numbers thing. But okay. there are a lot of emotional people out there, you know, and we deal with them, and we know how to deal with them. So if you're emotional, call us. We <laughs> exactly. want to help you. So re really quickly, Salt Lake County single family. There's 300. Uh, excuse me, 353 active listings right now on on the MLS, and out of those. 108 are actually under 500,000. Now that includes um, condos and townhomes, but if somebody's like, wow, it's just too expensive, that's all relative. Yeah. You know, and rates have gone up, but you know what? Still busy. <laughs> I don't think the sky's falling, and I honestly think, yeah, we've been in winter, and I think the spring's gonna be better. Yeah, we're seeing a lot more um, homes come on the market just in the last couple of weeks, which is totally. great news. Great news. Uh, we're, our inventory is still low, though. That's Inventory is still low, but I think it's catching up to last year at this time. Yeah. So I'm really encouraged by that. There's currently 1,900 um, under contract in Salt Lake County. <clears throat> in the last 30 days, we've had just over 900 homes sell. I'm starting to lose my voice. <laughs> <coughs> so we are finished yeah. for today. We love you. As okay. always, we want to talk to you. Call us with any real estate questions. Take care.